So guys, Joel Cancelo, the Manchester City footballer, was assaulted during a burglary at his home address. He put up a post on Instagram explaining what happened and of his injuries. He said, unfortunately today I was assaulted by four cowards who hurt me and tried to hurt my family. When you show resistance, this is what happens. They manage to take all my jewellery and leave me with my face in this state. The most important thing for me is my family and luckily they're all okay. And after so many obstacles in my life, this is just one more that I will overcome firm and strong like always time and time again we are seeing footballers targeted at their home address the place they're meant to feel safe away from the spotlight not long ago i covered the story of gabriel the arsenal player who had his home broken into as well he was standing in the garage and had to fight off the robber as well Manchester City put a statement saying Joel and his family are being supported by the club. He is helping the police with their inquiries as they investigate this serious matter. We are shocked and appalled that Joel Cancelo and his family were subject to a burglary at their home this evening which Joel was also assaulted. One of the craziest things about when people target footballers and try to rob them is they think footballers won't fight back because they got so much money, it's not even worth it, just let them take it and they can replace it next week. But every footballer I've covered from Ozil and the other Arsenal player that got into a situation, the recent Arsenal player Gabriel and now Cancelo as well, they all fight back and don't have it at all when people try to rob them. Footballers do live very crazy lifestyles and have an unbelievable amount of money but that doesn't make them an easy target. They're going to fight back, they're athletes at the end of the day as well and a certain amount of pride when someone comes into your home. I didn't think people would carry on trying to take advantage of these footballers because of how many failed cases there has been and how much of a high profile case is going to be if you do manage to get away with stuff like in the Rhys James case that I covered where they took his medals, it's everywhere. Leave a like to support the channel and of course subscribe with that notification bell if you're new. I'll see you guys all in my next video. Peace out.